A local emergency shelter gets a big boost as we head into the cold winter months. Christian Hauser found out how that money will be used to help people experiencing homelessness. The emergency shelter of Northern Kentucky is receiving $180,000 in grants. 130,000 of that is coming from St. Elizabeth. The remaining 50,000 is coming from the Greater Cincinnati Foundation. Now all this money will go to improving care and outcomes at the shelter. Executive Director Kim Webb says the grant money will cover several things, one of which is a 12-person handicapped accessible shuttle van, which will also be used by street outreach to pick up those without a place to stay and drive them to the shelter. It's also about getting individuals to medical care. It's also about getting individuals to jobs. It is about connecting them to services. The funds will also be used to create a full-time position for a mobile street outreach worker. They will be focused on delivering basic survival items like food, coats, and sleeping bags. They can also refer to get folks the care they need. And Webb says the money will allow the shelter to help more than just those who come in for a place to sleep. Can we help you with getting to a doctor's appointment? Can we get you connected to benefits and things like that? I think those are all, those are all services that really matter to the individual that says, you know, I don't have to enter the shelter to do that. The $50,000 from the Greater Cincinnati Foundation will go to support the expanded services the shelter will offer when it opens up a new facility a few blocks away. Now, there will also be a full-time care specialist at that new facility. It will help people find the care they need, working with St. Elizabeth and law enforcement to find a bed for someone experiencing homelessness. In Covington, Christian Hauser, Local 12 News. Now that new shelter facility could open by the end of the month. It'll double the amount of space they currently have.